Wow. Well, here we are. The second to last episode of Total Roblox Island, Third Time's the Charm. All I can say is thank you. It's been one heck of a wild ride through these three seasons on this island and with you, the audience at home. Thank you so much for watching and supporting this show and loving every second of it. Now, I know I'm making it seem like this is the final season, and no, that's not it at all, actually. What I'm saying is that after season three, Total Roblox Island might go on a bit of a small break. Or it might not, I don't know yet, but the producers haven't exactly given us the okay for a season four, so we will see. But it's okay, because this break is not permanent. It'll give us enough time to pick a fresh batch of contestants, think of some even more creative challenges, and also help me focus on my new talk show. So, with that said, let's finish off this glorious third season with a bang. But, before we can get there, we have one final challenge before the finale. So, without further ado, welcome to the second to last episode of Total Roblox Island, Third Time's the Charm. Hello, all you wonderful contestants. I don't know if it's just me, but personally, I am really excited to be here right now. So, I've got a really exciting challenge for this second to last episode. Let me guess, do I have to jump a pit of sharks uh, by riding off some ramp with some skis? Or do I have to tightrope walk across a volcano, risking my life? <laughs> I wish! Those challenges sound awesome! In fact, uh, hey, can you take some notes over there in the production booth? Thanks! Oh, I really hope that I'm allowed to use those in the next season. Oh my gosh! I just screwed over so many future contestants! I'm sorry! Anyway, today's challenge is... Hey, who turned off the lights? Uh, Mr. Skeleton Slasher? How could there be a light switch? We're outside, on an island. Oh, shut up, noob. Ah! <laughs> what happened? Oh my gosh! Oh, jeez! Oh, guys, what happened? I think something knocked me out. Oh! Why is this in my hand? I didn't do it! Nub, detain him! Murderer! Get off me, you crazy noob! I'm telling you, I didn't do it! Hey, 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 what the heck is going on over here? Oh my goodness! Who are you? I'm the producer of this show, and I've been working with Mr. Slasher for over a year now. Wait, so does that mean there was a different producer for the first season? Shut up, don't get all freaking. I don't know, don't go that deep into the lore. We gotta figure out who killed this guy! Okay, he's right. We've all gotta calm down for just a second and figure out why the heck Skeleton Slasher is dead. And, most importantly, who done it? No, 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 it's not gonna be all buddy-buddy like that. I don't trust any of you. You all had reasons to do it. Or, as they're called in court, motives. You, prison guy, you hated Skeleton for his over-the-top deadly challenges and feared putting your life on the line. Nub, you're a villain, why wouldn't you want to kill someone? And Noob! Oh, noob. You had the biggest reason out of anyone. You weren't supposed to be on this season. Skeleton rejected you, but you came here yourself. And you took revenge. Actually, it could have been any one of you. Now hold on a second, smart guy. Who's to say it's not you? You probably have a motive as well. In fact, I'm sure I can figure it out right now. You said that you've been the producer for Skeleton Shows for over a year, which means that you weren't the producer for the first season of Total Roblox Island, which implies that he rejected your application in the same way he rejected Noob. There. A blatant motive right there. Uh, well, okay. We all have motives. It's, it's probably Prison Guy, you know? He's a prisoner. No, 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 no. You do not have proof. In fact, I, I, I mean, you don't have any proof for anyone. It can't be me, right? Right, you guys believe me, right? You know who it is, is it's probably Noob. Skeleton Slasher's the reason that I earn Robux. Why would I want to kill him? But Swear I'm not the villain this time. Everyone shut up! We've got to calm down and fix this, solve this rationally. What? 
Sorry, one sec, guys. The computer in the producer's booth is going whack. Oh, oh my gosh! What? 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 What happened? It said that if we don't figure out who killed Skeleton Slasher, the man behind the mask, I guess, is gonna kill us all. So we gotta figure out the murderer, or else we will become the murdered. I guess you could say he was the man behind the slaughter. Now is not the time for dead memes, noob. That's it. We're gonna play this like a good old-fashioned game of Clue. Except minus the game, more murder. We're all gonna split up and look for something. Anything incriminating that can solve this, okay? And let's just all walk away calmly. I'm not turning my back. Yeah, I'm just gonna go with him. Yep, okay, I'm getting away from you crazies as fast as possible. So, you guys are just gonna leave me here with a dead body? Nope! That producer guy seemed kinda sketchy. I've got a really bad feeling about him. I don't know why, but there's something about that producer that just doesn't sit right with me. That producer is turning everyone against me! It's gotta be him, but I've gotta find a way to prove it first. Well, I guess if I wanna find some dirt on him, I'll have to investigate the producer's booth. I think I'm actually gonna go back and search the crime scene itself. Then again, it could be Prisoner. I'm gonna follow him and see where he goes. Alright, dead body, check. Murder weapon, check. Blood, not present because this channel is cheap. But there's a body and a knife, so yeah, this checks out as a murder scene. Wait, what was the point of this? All right, so it seems like, I mean, he's got a lot of stuff here, but this is all stuff a producer of a show would have. Computer access to everything used to basically make the show what it is and get the raw footage. Wait, what's, what's that but, ugh. A button! Okay, now we're getting somewhere. Time to figure out what this does. All right, now let's see what you're up to, you sketchy prisoner. All right, here we go. Okay, what did that do? Wait a second. It turned off the light stands that the employees were using. Oh, I think I just found some proof. All right, now it's just time to- Oh, jeez, what are you doing here? I'm following you, you sketchy son of a gun. What do you mean, sketchy? That producer is clearly the murderer, and he's tricked you, just like he tricked Noob into thinking that it's me. I'm telling you, it is not me. You will all see. That sounds like something a murderer would say. And also, that rhymed. Ah, what does that have to do with anything? Just, just leave me alone. Huh. Seems even sketchier than before. Wait a second. He said this button controls the lights that the employees were using. And they're in the producer booth. Since he's the producer, it would make sense for him to have access to all the technology for the show. That means that he had access to the lights. He could have been the one that turned them off. So when nobody was looking, he turned off the lights, and in the cover of darkness, he committed the crime. He killed Skeleton Slasher. We gotta go apprehend him right now. We gotta go capture him. Ah, what do I do? Nub! Nub! Ow! Ugh, that's why you never run in the same direction. Uh, the producer's the murderer! I figured it out! Me too! He's the one who turned off the lights! I committed the murder! Uh, oh, hey guys. Uh, did you figure out who the murderer was? Uh, yeah, we did. And I think it's pretty clear to see now. You, as the producer, have access to every piece of technology used for filming the raw footage of the show and getting every angle precise and correct in that director's booth, which means that you had access to the lights. When nobody was looking, you flipped the switch to turn the lights off, grabbed your weapon, and struck Skeleton Slasher. Then, before you turned the lights back on, you knocked out Prisoner with one punch, put the knife in his hand, and tried to get us to believe that it was him. You tried to frame him! That's right, Producer McGee. We foiled your complicated little murder plan, and now you're gonna pay the price for it. <laughs> bravo, bravo. 
You've all done really well. In fact, I'm surprised your peanut brains even got past step one. But now that you've solved this mystery, I'm afraid that I can't let any of you leave. That's a stupid idea. It's three versus one. We could easily take you down right now. Very good point. But you're all forgetting. I'm the producer, which means I know everything about you. You're the contestants that I gave the okay to. What I'm trying to say is that I have dirt on every single one of you. And that if you guys take me down and get me punished, I'll expose each and every one of you. Noob, I seem to be the only one who cares that you harass people and punch them every single day. Nub, I know what your top secret plans are for this show. Top secret plans? Um, he's not talking about anything. And you! <laughs> yes, you, prisoner. I've got the biggest secret of yours. Your true occupation. Your true identity. And how you've been lying to not only Skeleton Slasher, but everyone on this show. So, do you all really want to take me down? Or can we just hide the body in some bush somewhere, and then leave the island and pretend like nothing ever happened? Y'all got that? So that's it then. You'll just go on blackmailing us with these lies that you're spreading? If it keeps you all from getting me punished, then of course! Why not? <laughs> well, I'll tell you why not. Hey! Good shot, Orange. Very good. Are you a murderer too? No, I'm a spy. And for that matter, I'm also Skeleton Slasher's personal bodyguard. There's a bigger story to this whole thing that he himself will explain shortly. But I'll give you my end of it. Not only am I a spy, but like I said, I'm also Skeleton Slasher's personal bodyguard that he hired for this season. He told me to blend in as a contestant. Because with all the stupid people that he's worked with, he's bound to do something dumb and, well, make someone angry. And that someone was this guy, and in this case, it drove him to violence. He even said that if I did a good enough job, I could go on and win the season, and the cash Robux prize would be my payment. Wait, did you just say Skeleton Slasher himself would explain the rest of the story? But, but how? I'll tell you how, noob. Because that's not the real Skeleton Slasher. Allow me to share my side of the story to intertwine perfectly with Agent Orange. So this fellow that Agent Orange just shot, well, I forgot to pay him once. And like the stupid idiot that he is, uh, he tried to kill me, which by the way, you should never do. So in the first episode of my new talk show, Biloxi Talk, <laughs> shameless plug, in the backstage room, I heard him ranting to the makeup artist about how he was really mad that I forgot to give him his sweet, sweet green paper. So, when the makeup artist left, I saw him writing something down. And then what he left, I went in, stealthily, and saw what he was writing down. It was his plot to kill me on live TV. Since this is Roblox, where anything is possible, I simply used this random cloning machine I had lying around and made a perfect replica of myself. He thought it was the real deal, and I used it for this episode only. So, you didn't just die right in front of me? Nope, I am still very much alive. And I'm afraid that it's time we say goodbye to Agent Orange. That's right. I'd love to stay and continue being a contestant on the show, but I can't. I'll have to leave you two as the two finalists. Now that my cover's been blown, I have no choice but to abort mission. So, I wish you guys the best of luck, and I hope to see you all some other time. Actually, speaking of which, here's my ride right now. Uh, well, like I said, I hope to see some of you again soon. And I wish you both the best of luck. Win the game for me! So, ladies and gentlemen, another contestant is gone. That means by the next episode, it'll be the final two. Who will win? Who will lose? Find out who gets a million Robux in the next episode!
the finale of Total Roblox Island, Revenge of the Blocks.